how much money does it cost to move to Africa? Good question. How much money does it cost to move anywhere, really? In the case of Africa, you have to remember that it's a whole continent. Africa is a continent populated by 54 countries, full of 54 countries. So they all have different governments, and that means different currencies, different markets, different industries, okay? There are some countries where, African countries, where you can't even be a digital nomad or Airbnb might not have made it to the country, um, certain kinds of food, you know, and on and on and on. But how can you figure out how much it would cost to move somewhere abroad, to move somewhere in Africa. Take a look at this clip that's about to come up where I just did a video tutorial, okay, on how to, uh, just, to just to guide you through Nembeo.com. And I just compared a couple of different countries to living in different parts of the United States. Because remember, USD also goes very, very far, okay? I know the United States, there's corruption and things like that, but, uh, and that's gonna be dealt with. But as of right now, if you're an American citizen, your USD goes further, okay? And so if you're not trying to tear nothing up or mess anything up, leverage that USD wherever that you're going in the world, okay? Okay, I have more here, okay? Caribbean, I have Caribbean healthcare as well, okay? And then there's also Nimbea. You can just put in calculate cost of living here. So you put in a country and then you compare it to something else, okay? So they got the map here. Right here, you can select a country. Let's see if I try it, okay? So select location, okay, Los Angeles. All right, compare it to Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. All right, cost of living in Los Angeles, California is 194.9% higher than in Dar es Salaam without rent. Okay, cost of living including rent in Los Angeles, 255% higher than Dar. Okay, and then here they have more facts, but then they get into meals, meals for two people. You know, restaurants, they get into markets here and they break it down certain things like milk, you know, white bread, rice, eggs, you know, basic stuff. They're comparing right here. Oh, yeah, because you'll want to get into uh, you'll want to research, you know, the uh, conversion rates, you know, the T shilling to the uh, U.S. dollar, you know, or the Ronde and Frank to the U.S. dollar or to the British pound, you know, wherever you're coming from. You know, they get into transportation monthly utilities, sports and leisure, child care. You see, so nimbeo.com is great, rent per month. Okay, salaries and financing, all right? So if you like that, just click the link in the gray video description box below and it will link you to the Epic Expat Research Guide where there's plenty more information where that came up beyond cost of living. Peace and blessings on your journey abroad. Informative. Reassuring. Um, transformative. Exciting. Thorough. Informative. Great experience. Enlightening. I bought this as a, a, a gift to myself for my birthday. Oh. And I'm happy that I did. It's been very comprehensive, encouraging, as Carla said. A lot of information, a lot to do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I'm, I'm pretty excited about it. So thanks, thanks so much. For me, it was uh, very motivating. It really got me to thinking and it enlightened me on, on a lot of different areas that I really hadn't thought about. So for me, I'm I'm ready. I'm excited. Did a great job. Covered everything. Um, it's, it's a lot to absorb. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. And I think you covered everything. So it's just a matter of uh, really just getting your system and your plan together. It's all for me. Thanks. Thanks for everything, y'all. Bradley's did a good job. Thank you um, for planning out this workshop. It's been great and extremely informative.
So thank you. There's a lot here. Be encouraged, small bites, so that you're not overwhelmed. Be encouraged. I feel that it was a very enlightening class. I've learned a lot of information and a lot of things that I hadn't even thought of thinking of. So this definitely was a good tool for me. All right. And, uh, I know how I, you know, I have a little action plan going on here. <laughs> then I know how I'm going to move forward and thank God for this class because prior to coming in, I was kind of all over, didn't really know where to start or, you know, the things that I really should focus on. I think the workshop was very helpful. Um, all the information about um, banking and about um, shipping.